What up, folks? It's your boy PJ, bringing you another war recap. We finished up our war against an Arab clan. Beat them 71 to 62. Uh, they didn't bring much. They didn't use all their attacks. And, um, you know, we scraped them pretty good. Almost three-starred one of their Town Hall 10s. Uh, and didn't clear one Town Hall 9. Um, don't know what's up with that. But, <clears throat> anyway, it was a relatively small war. We had some people uh, sitting out and upgrading heroes and such, so uh, we got some good attacks to show you. Um, we're going to start off with Tiny Pickle versus number 9. Tiny is bringing a Govalo. He's going to start by loose, uh, loosening up those defense, softening up those defenses on the south. One loon each, I think. Uh, not a whole lot is targeting them. Uh, takes out a couple of cannons. He's got a, ho a, a hog in there to help take out that last cannon and get the clan castle lore, which he does. And he'll take out that clan castle with, um, with poison. We'll take, take out the loons with poison, weaken that dragon, and then he'll do the clan castle kill at the north. The Valk part of this, you'll see he's going to bring his golems and Valks in at the top part of the base, jump for that junction um, no wall breakers just to jump right there on that air sweeper at the top and the Valks are pretty much going to handle the entire core and then he's got hogs um, not a lot of hogs um, but two heels and they don't have a, a big portion once the Valks wreck all that interior of the base uh, they just have that bottom bottom part to take care of so you'll see the Golems are moving in, the jump spells down, Barbarian King starting to make his way in. And here come the Valks. Barbarian King almost took a took a walk, but redirected nicely. And uh here in a second, yep, Valks are there in the core. Sorry, I forgot. I thought he used both heels on his hogs, but um maybe just maybe just one. Hogs are in. They've already really taken out the only point defenses there at the bottom that can actually hurt them. And uh, Valks have completed their job. And that's pretty much it. Just a, you know, a couple little defenses. Archer Queen's helping out there on the left. And the uh, Hogs have just enough to get the right side done by themselves. Tons of Valks up. I don't know if you lost a single Valk. There is the three star. Awesome job, Tiny. Next, let's take a look at Nat Farge versus number 12. Farge is bringing 49 hogs. No other troops. I don't know if I've ever seen this. You know, maybe, maybe this is. I don't know, maybe people, you know, have fun doing this attack from time to time. I personally have never seen it. Uh, uses a, a couple hogs there on the left hand side to get the Archer Queen's attention and his Barbarian King. Um, aggro's directly onto her. The other step is to take out the clan castle. Uh, since there's a loon and two loons and dragon, he's able to take out the loons and weaken the dragon with poison. And then he is going to kill the dragon just with a couple shots of the queen under ability. Now there's there's none of the typical things that you need to deal with um, with your kill squad, the clan castle and the archer queen. So he's just going to pour in his hogs. Um, kind of surgical style. He's got more than half down, but still, actually, he's got almost exactly half down. Uh, still at 21, and now he has nine left. He's gonna send the last nine d down toward the bottom at those uh those cannons, and uh, I mean they're, they're just demolishing it. There's not a whole lot else to say. Bad, you know, not not a, not a great base. It could be confusing for some people, not really know how to how to approach it, but Nat Farge just uh, embarrasses it. 49 hogs, that's phenomenal. A lot of fun to watch. Next up, let's take a look at Daddy Bison versus 19. Daddy is bringing a Town Hall 8 Govalo. Um, a lot of, lot of fun with this one. Uh, I, there's a, there was a couple little things that I was, uh, one little thing that I was confused about. Maybe it was just a safety precaution. Uh, but you'll see after he pulls the clan castle up here to the top, takes care of the dragon. He doesn't, he, the, the poison's almost like an afterthought. 
um, but it doesn't matter. He's using the the one by one um, spawned uh, barbar barbarians to distract the dragon. Now he's got these two um, these two giants down, um, and he sends in wall breakers to open up that compartment, and then sends a golem. Maybe just wanted to make sure the golem has extra hit points uh, for the core. But I think he could have just dropped that golem and accomplished the same thing. Distracted those uh, two. They would have reached that cannon and archer tower. Anyway, in any event, I'm not nitpicking. It was, it's a sweet attack. You see his Valks are coming in. He has Wiz on either side to um, make the funnel wide enough. Um, he, he uses one wall breaker to open that first layer. And then, the, and then the rage helps the Valks get through the second layer. There's nowhere else to go. They have to go through that second layer of wall. So... Um, nice planning from Daddy Bison. He's got all his all his spells helping out those Valks and the Barbarian King in the middle. They're going to take out all the air defenses and those Teslas and everything else. And he's got loons coming in. Perfect timing. Uh, I think they, they reach their targets at the exact right moment. None of the loons take a single shot from the air defenses. Um, but neither do they arrive so late that they end up not contributing. Um their major force take out almost take out all of those perimeter defenses last cannon goes down and it is clean up awesome job town hall 8 go valo really enjoyed it next lastly we'll show polo 707 versus 20 polo is bringing this town hall 8 drag attack the new New drag attack with two lightnings and an earthquake leaves a rage left over. Takes out that top air defense. He's going to send his dragons against the left air defense. And he's got nine hogs, four level four hogs, and five level five hogs in the clan castle. He's got those hogs to take out the right air defense. So one air defense is down. Nice funnel. He's going to drop his rage on the uh, dragons here in a second. Rage is down. Um, a dragon in the enemy clan castle. It's no problem for his rage dragons. And you see the hogs have just have taken out the last air defense. And yeah, yeah, I mean, this base is done. Um, it's really just clean up. We'll, we'll speed it up a little bit because um, none of those defenses are enough to derail he's got seven eight ha eight eight dragons still up seven dragons still up and his barbarian king that loon's going to chase his barbarian king around the board uh unsuccessfully i think and uh while well, the dragons finish the cleanup so if you know if you're town hall eight and you're not consistently three if you don't have like a 90 percent hit rate on these symmetrical internet town hall eight bases and you, know, you need to brush up on uh some of the techniques that are out there because this Two lightning, one earthquake, dragon attack is uh, it, it's doing a lot of work at Town Hall 8 these days. Anyway, that's all we got for this war, uh, and I will see you next time with the next war recap.